two of the biggest names in the global game going head to head. Football matches barely come any more mouthwatering than the Derby d'Italia. It is a fixture that has seen so many great moments over the years. Great goals, great players. And every time Derby Day comes around again, it feels like the first time. And fans expect something special. It asks an awful lot, of course, for the players to perform amid such a big atmosphere. But these are amongst the world's biggest stars. And it is for days like this that they invest so much in their careers. It is feverish ahead of kickoff. Nothing, of course, is certain. The fans have been going at it full tilt for hours now, turning the stadium into a real bear pit. The moment comes, though, when fans turn their attention only to the players and players to the task ahead. These are the days when legends are made. So what a stage for the players to take to here ahead of such an important game. Well, it's a friendly in theory, but we are expecting this to be fiercely contested. Well, I'm sitting here, Peter, thinking, is it possible for these two to meet under friendly circumstances? This exhibition match is likely to exhibit the same old rivalry. To me, it also has the same feel to it. And I'm pretty sure we can look forward to what will be a combative, high-intensity affair. We can't really say anything negative about this. And if it is full-on, then I'll be happy to watch that. Well, if you did just miss it, we are up and running already. Jim, you've played in games of this nature. Who can make the difference? Yeah, Arturo Vidal. He's always a massive asset because everyone teammates and opponents alike no he'll never stop running up to meet it good try the outcome could so easily have been different a more than decent attempt Peter just brushed off the ball there Ericsson Ericsson with the crossfield ball and it's young He wasn't very far from making something happen by himself. Lovely to see. Alexandro. Ashley Young. Looks to clip it forward. Bentancur. Chiesa. Quadrado. Kaku. Inter have opted to really stretch the game now. Yeah, that's pretty evident, but what's their thinking? Um, I, it looks as if the opposition are happy to defend the width of the 18-yard box, trying to remove that compactness. Tries to get it clear. He's had a shot! Lovely goal, perfect poise to set himself for the strike. Juventus put themselves into the lead. He's just gone and reminded us yet again of what a threat he carries. And it's Young. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Arthur. Promising move that. Good inroads into enemy territory, but no joy. Arthur gets it back.
Quadrado. Ball's gone out of play. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Keeper sends it forward. Aimed in towards the centre. Bentancur. And now they can launch a counter. Kolarov switches it towards the other side. Vidal. 30 minutes gone. Hardly anything between the sides. And the score is 1-0. It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. Vidal. Into Milan, have a free kick. Bentancur is being told in no uncertain terms that this will be his final warning. Yeah, and he's just entered the last chance saloon. One wrong move now, and he's in trouble. And here's Ashley Young. Chesney claims it. Bentancur. Ericsson battles to win it back. Now the counter. He's gone for it! Sticks it away! Well, it certainly livened things up a bit, and that next goal now is absolutely crucial. Was there ever any doubt? Yeah, that's brilliant from him. Such a, a calm finish. Just pick your spot, don't think about what the keeper's going to do. Concentrate on what you have to do. That has added a whole new complexion to the game. Yeah, for me, both sides are strong and well-matched, and I think you need to be a good player to be out there right now. Now it's... A and the shot! Arthur... Hoists it high. Skriniar does well there. Alert. Vidal drives it forward. Hoists it forward. Looks to thread it through. Looking to break out here. Plenty of appeals, but the referee is not interested. De Ligt. He's looked long this time. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. And that'll be the last act of the first half. So, a very watchable game so far. Action at both ends and the team's level. So, both teams heading off for the break. An interesting game has brewed up here. Hoping perhaps for a little bit more from both parties in the second half. But the score at half-time is 1-1. So we're just settling back into this second half. Alexandro gets his foot in there. Arthur. Surely. And it's Dybala. Lukaku. Ashley Young tries to get it forward quickly. It's got through to him. D'Ambrosio. Chiesa. Stefan de Vrij. Vidal. 
Kolarov goes looking. Across the field it goes. Alexandro cuts it out. Yeah, it looks like a, a change of approach and it may just freshen things up. D'Ambrosio. Vidal. Out to the right. Ashley Young. Now it's Ashley Young. Forward it goes. Vidal. Eriksen has created one goal already. Oh, it's opened up nicely for him. Oh, that is asking for trouble. That's the throw. Kolarov plays it over to the other flank. And it's Young. That's great strength on the ball. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Well, the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Well played, he saw that coming. And it's played forward. Chiesa. Cristiano Ronaldo. It's one! Perfect placement, the one place the keeper couldn't reach. Now that's what I call finishing, right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was where and didn't need to waste any time weighing things up. That's a cracking goal. Checks on the touchline, a change about to occur. Juventus get themselves into the lead. Well, that's the currency he deals in, and he's come good yet again. Never the one to let you down in these situations. Dybala pushes to get on the end of it. Martinez. Martinez gets it out to the wing. It's got through. Shoots! Oh, should have been the equaliser. Makes you think, Peter, they could have been doing this earlier. Still, it's encouraging. And the changes then in quick succession. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but you couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. Inter are definitely not going down without a scrap. Their attitude just can't be faulted. Ronaldo floats one over. Juventus are looking to make this one safe. They want to reduce the risk. It has got through to him. Vidal plays it forward. Juventus, and the whistle has gone for a reckless challenge there. And that's going to be a booking. Time is ticking away, and they're playing as if they're defending a lead. They've got to get it up the pitch. That's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Brozovic. Lukaku plays it out to the flank. Going through. Nice touch. And here's Lukaku. And that is it. The referee has seen enough. Juventus come out on top. Hard fought, impossible to predict. In the end, though, only the result mattered.
Well, how will we look back on that? Juventus made their intentions clear that nothing else but a win would do. These games are always tough, but it's, it's not always about...